grace i come here with the word and also we do our prayers here you are in the right place god bless you i want to share this word with someone this is something that dropped on my heart and i want to share with you this morning there is a serious transformation that is going to take place it's already happening it has begun already it has already started and God is still going to continue moving in that dimension. And so I'm here to tell you congratulations, congratulations, congratulations once again, because the Lord is moving in your life. Now, this has been a very powerful, beautiful and revealing season for many of us. It has been a season of clarity, a season of understanding, a season of light, a season of depth as well, a season of openings, a season where God has opened a lot to us, a season of growth a season of increase a season of transformation a season of transformation family there's a lot god is doing and he's bringing in serious transformation in our lives and i see god doing much more in your life there are things god is going to bring your way that will blow your mind as a result of this transformation there are opportunities god will release to you that will blow your mind as a result of him transforming you bringing what was on the inside of you taking away the old bringing in the new introducing the new to you revealing what you never knew your heart there is a transformation that is going on there is a transformation that will hit someone now i want to tell you this the bible says when god opens a door no man can shut and he has started doing a thing in your life no man can stop it the door has been opened and no man can shut it the lord has started working and no man can stop him hallelujah all he needs for you to do is to come in alignment with what he's doing agree with him let him do what needs to be done in your life and after that, you will watch your life turn around in a way that you least expected. You will watch him transform you. Everything about you is going to change. Everything about you is going to turn around. That is the God that we serve. When we let him have his way, he blows our mind, family. When we are patient with the Lord, he comes in and does powerful things that we couldn't have done. Things that we never even saw coming. I want to tell someone and encourage someone today, never ever give up on yourself. No matter how hard things are and no matter what you have done, God is able to forgive. God is able to transform. God is able to renew us and he's able to bless us again never give up on yourself never become discouraged about yourself no matter how many times you fall be ready to stand again and try again because there is room for success even for those who have failed there is room for growth even for those who are still little there is room for increase even for those that are still small the Lord has made it so you can grow, you can increase, you can become better than who you are right now. God can bless you again. God can increase you again. I'm here to encourage you with these words. The Lord is bringing a serious transformation. That's why you see a lot of things that have been happening in your life seems like, you know, an attack, especially this season, is because even the enemy has seen this transformation coming. Some of us, after God is done, you will not be able to recognize yourself anymore. You will not be thinking the same way that you used to think. You will not see things the same way that you used to see them because the Lord will change so much about you. It's not just about the physical, but about the spiritual, about the psychological part of your life as well. The Lord is getting ready to transform you. And I'm here to tell you congratulations. God has started a thing and he will perfect it in your life and destiny in the name of Jesus. And I pray and I'm waiting as well for your testimony. And you come back with testimonies for his glory. Remember this, don't ever give up. You may be going through that process right now, but there is an end result. The end is wonderful. God bless you. Thank you so much. So grateful that you came here to listen. Have a wonderful, wonderful Sunday once again. And if this is not a Sunday that you're listening to, have a wonderful day. God bless you. Please, if this was a blessing, go on and like it. Subscribe if you are new. Share the word with someone you know is going to need it. And I should do so. May the Lord bless you. In